Thank you to Genshin Impact for sponsoring this video. In this world, you get to choose who you want to be. You want to have the powers of a pyromaniac? You got it. You want electro powers? You can have that too. Or how about ice powers, cooler than your ex's heart? Easy. With so many options available, you might be wondering what I chose. <laughs> I would want the strongest one of them all, of course. I chose to be an NPC. Greetings, traveler. You're a bit famished now, aren't you? Luckily for you, you're at just the right Skip. plate. We offer the freshest produce in all of Teva. I guarantee you won't be disappointed by our Skip. select. We have chicken mushroom skewer, which will heal you right back we up. We have chicken mushroom. I don't care about your stupid little skewer. I'm here to buy some tomatoes. Why are you talking so much? You might be wondering how I opened this shop. Well, Skip, I don't care. I swear, if you say another word that does not involve me buying tomatoes, I'm going to chop you and your stupid little shack up in pieces. I'm, I'm sorry, sorry, man. man. I was programmed like this. this. I can't, I can't say, say anything, anything else. else. He then passed the shop on to me, which I will then pass it on to my son. And then my son will probably pass it on to his son. And then that son will probably pass it on to his son. And then that son will probably... Well, I didn't really choose to be an NPC. I was created like this, which is both a bad thing and good thing. Good thing because... What a waste of time. I don't even want your tomatoes. You better hope I don't come back. See you next time, traveler. Oh, oh my, my god, god, shut, shut up, up, bro. Why are you still talking? And it's a bad thing because I can't do anything else besides what I was programmed to do. Like, see that rock laying in the middle of my shop? I can't even move to pick it up, even though it's been annoying me ever since the game's release. But even worse, I can't go outside to see what the world has to offer. I'm just stuck here in this small little shop with a stupid rock teasing me. If only I could just... I can't believe it. I'm actually moving. Can I... Can I talk? Greetings, traveler. You're a bit famished now, aren't you? Luckily for you, you're at just the right place. <sighs> One step at a time, I guess. Still, I can't believe it. I'm free. I'm free. So this is what it feels like to be able to go anywhere. It's amazing. The beautiful grass, the beautiful sky, the beautiful music. Wait, why did the music just get so intense? Is something going on? <coughs> what the hell is that thing? There's no end to this. I'm not invincible anymore. I can't afford to get hit again. At the end of the day, I'm still just an NPC. If I die, there's only one way out of this. Ah! Help! 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 I'm talking! Oh! Oh, I'm actually talking! Let's go! There's no end to this. Oh, a weapon! Does anyone have a weapon? Garbage, how is this possible? What is that? Oh, this? You must be new. This is an acquaint fate and they used to grant wishes. The wishes will give you a three to five star item depending on how lucky you get. As you can see, I've been very unlucky. But if you're looking to get some of these, I can explain how it all works. Oh, no, it's okay. Basically, you can buy acquaint fates with primo gems which you earn by doing quests. However, it's not that easy though since you have to save up 160 primo gems just to buy one acquaint. This can often take hours of work since you have to do a lot of quests. These quests range anywhere from easy to hard. But watch out. Skip. Did you just try to skip my dialogue? So basically, that thing will give me a weapon. Yes, I had 20 of these and I only pulled three star weapons. 
This is my last one. I worked about eight hours to earn this. Had to overcome many challenges. Save many lives. I'll trade you a chicken mushroom skewer for it. Did you even hear what I was just saying? Come on, man, please. This is all I have. <sighs> Keep it. You probably have better luck than me anyways. A five star, huh? You must, you must have to be, be really lucky, lucky to get, get one of those. those. I'll be happy, happy with, with just, just a three star, star though. As long as it helps me explore this world. No way. A two star weapon? I thought you said the minimum I would get is a three star. That's what I thought too. I don't know how this happened. I've never seen this before in all my time playing this game. <sighs> I can't believe I almost gave you my chicken mushroom skewer for this. Where is he? Who? So you're still here. There's no end to this. Trust me. This time there will be. Unlucky. Have a taste of this. See, it was okay after all. One more hit is all it would have taken. Ah! I'm risking my life being out here. And for what? I was pretty happy in that small little shop. Now that I think about it. It was nice seeing all those happy customers. I didn't even mind that rock that much. It's dangerous out here. What was I thinking? I want to go back. Is this you? Who are you? I'm doing a quest called The Runaway NPC. The Runaway NPC. An NPC has escaped. Got him back to his shop. Or dispose of him. Well, which one is it? So? If you guys want to explore the Genshin world just like that NPC did, make sure to download it using my link down below. The game is somehow free and is available on iOS, Android, PC, and PlayStation. If you love RPGs, then this game is a must-have. If you don't, let me try to persuade you, because I'm actually having a lot of fun playing this game. Imagine a world where you have hundreds of things to explore. Different environments, characters, weapons. It's a game where you just have fun exploring and going on adventures, which you can also do with your friends because there is a co-op mode. Also, the music. I can't get over how incredible it is. All the music used in this video is music that you actually find in the game. Like that battle music you heard is actually battle music in the game. Genshin Impact also just got updated to version 2.0, so they definitely are trying to keep things fresh. Funny story, a new 5-star character named Ayaka recently came out and I had no idea how rare it was, but I pulled her from a wish on my second try. And my brother just started screaming. Which brings me to my next point. You don't actually need to pay to win for this game. I know someone who hasn't paid a single dime and they have almost all the characters unlocked, just from playing a lot. Like, 
maybe a bit too much. But yeah, make sure to at least give the game a try. It's free so you don't lose anything. Once again, link is in the description down below. Thanks for watching, guys.